Hello basketball coaches and basketball players. My name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training and today I'm gonna to show you some fantastic full court press basketball plays that you can run against a man-to-man -man defense full court that will always beat it. So hello everyone, my name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training. If you're new to this channel, on this channel I show you basketball plays, drills, and skills. So if you like that stuff, hit that like button and subscribe. On Tuesdays and Thursdays, I show you individual basketball skills and drills so that you can become a better basketball player. Now, on this video, I'm going to show you some fantastic plays that are going to crush your opponent if they want to do a full court press on you, man to man. So let's get down to the down to the clipboard and let's check out these basketball plays. Okay, so first what we have is obviously our inbounder. We're going to have two players at the elbows and our two bigger players on the opposite side of the court past the half court line. Now, the idea behind that is to get player 1 open for an easy basket full court. So what we are going to do is we're going to obviously clear out the side, set a screen for player one, who's going to use that screen. And because both of these post players are on this side of the court, this is going to leave this whole side of the court open. And we're going to inbounds the ball to player one. And if he's fast enough, he can get down for a layup nice and easily. On his way down towards the net, we're going to have player 4 and player 5 cutting towards the rim, both of which may be options to have the ball pass to them, especially player 5, because if player 5's man wants to play help defense to cut off that lane that player 1 has, that's going to leave player 5 wide open for that layup. Now, in our next play that I'm going to show you, this is another one that is really great. What we are going to have is player one setting a screen for player two, who is going to be popping down to this opposite corner. Now, he should get that bounce pass. Make sure not to do a chest pass or over the head pass because there's a gigantic backboard here that will get you every single time. So, make sure they watch out for that. And... Player 2 gets the ball. Now what we're going to do, Player 2 Red is obviously going to fight through and try and defend Player 2. Player 2 might take a few dribbles up, but what we are looking for now is Player 5 to come down and Player 4 to come down and set screens for Player 2 as well as Player 3. Now Player 3 is going to use that screen, Player 2 is going to come down, Player 2 Red is going to get caught hopefully in that screen. It'll be funny if there's a mismatch and they switch off to play defense. That would be pretty funny. But now we have a two on possibly none or two on two if they switched off. And because we have two faster players going against two slower players, generally speaking, historically speaking, that's going to be a huge mismatch. The only thing is, is if these guys are fast and these guys are fast but they're shorter, there may be a big block. So they need to be smart, but at least you got the ball past half court, which is the main thing in a press break. Now, there are ways of running a one-man press break. I will be making that video very soon over the next two weeks and teaching players how you could be a one-man press break yourself. Now, I hope that you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, hit that like button, subscribe. I do post new videos every single day, so I'll see you guys again tomorrow for another daily basketball video.